Hello and welcome. My name's Phil Grundy and I'm the principal of Hyams Park School. It is with great sadness that this year I'm not able to welcome you in person in the same way as we would have done previously. The face masks and hand sanitizer that we're used to, it's not really a parents evening as we would be used to, but hopefully you'll find these videos helpful in judging whether Hyams Park School is the one for you. It's a huge privilege to be principal of Hyams Park School. Um, I've been here now for nearly five years. Um, before arriving at Hyams Park, I worked in several of our neighbouring boroughs, um, Essex, Havering and Newham. Um, I'm also, um, pre in a previous life, uh, a PE teacher uh, and an English teacher. Um, perhaps most importantly, I'm also a parent myself of four children going through education. Two now off at university, one completing their A-levels this year and one just starting his GCSEs this year. So a principal, but also a parent. One of the frustrations with this being a virtual tour is you're not able to meet in person all of the people that you would be able to normally on our open evening. As you can see, running a school is not about one person. It's not a one-man band. It's packed full of lots of other people, whether that be leadership teams, heads of department and heads of year, class teachers, support staff, and perhaps most importantly of all, the students themselves. As our motto suggests, success through our endeavours, it's a team approach to being successful. Um, the slide here really does show how important it is that teachers, that parents and students work together. Those three sections make up a wheel that will run smoothly, a journey that will be smooth, and that absolutely is our intention through your seven years here at Himes Park. Normally at this point, I would talk through some of the quotes that you can see on the, the slide and then encourage you when you went on your tours to speak to the students and listen to their first-hand experiences of their first few weeks here at school. Unfortunately, this year, that's just not possible. So please do. Can I encourage you to look at some of the other clips that we've put together? We've got interviews with Year 7 students who have only been here for a couple of weeks, but they're keen to share their experiences with you. The school's core values are, I would suggest, the really important thing for you students and indeed parents to look through and to say, do they align with your views as to what is important? Um, you won't be able to read them all here. Um, they are available in depth on the website. But there's quite a lot of information contained within there, but I was really keen on taking over as principal to be able to condense these into a motto and some core behaviours that were easy to remember and then central to everything that we do. So I've already mentioned many times our um, motto, success through our endeavours. Well, how do you achieve that and what does it look like? Um, other colleagues have spoken about academic success and indeed pastoral success. I'll let you watch their individual clips on those. I do want to talk briefly though about the core behaviours, our three R's, respect, responsibility and resilience. We at Himes Park firmly believe that these attributes are not only applicable to Himes Park School but really do apply to life and we look to turn out students who have these values embedded in everything that they do. Obviously the purpose of these videos is so that you can choose which school feels right for you and I do share your frustration in not being able to see the school at work, meet the students en masse as you would do normally. However, I do hope that these clips are helpful to you in making those choices. Um, one area that inevitably people will also look to are the Ofsted reports. Please do look through those, they're available for you on our website. Um, I am just going to pull out a couple of quotes from our most recent inspection. Not because it's what Ofsted says, but actually because I think it's what I would want as a parent and certainly what I want as a head teacher. Um, it talks of the commitment and ambition that is shared within the Himes Park community. It talks about staff and I would add students who are proud to work and come to Himes Park School. Hopefully you can see that in the interviews and discussions that are recorded for you. Um, I do think it's also important to point out the, 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 the point made about adults dealing with problems straight away. There are, of course, in your seven year journey here at Himes Park School, challenges for everybody. Things that go really well, but also sometimes difficulties that you run into. 
and we've got a highly experienced team of colleagues who are here on hand to deal with those. Not to deny that they exist, but to say let's work through them together and we will find a solution. And indeed the final comment there is one from a parent made and recorded just expressing their real pleasure at the fact that their child was supported through some of those ups and downs. One of the things that we really do try to develop here at Hyams Park as well is opportunity to do different activities. We have a dedicated activities week um, towards the end of the year where students do all manner. You can see some of the pictures of, uh, of different activities that go on. Um, similarly, school shows, sporting activities that really stretch and develop the character of students in different ways. Having said that, at the moment, many of these things are on pause with COVID and trying to keep different year groups apart. So disappointingly, um, we haven't worked out how all of these things will work in these current times. Normally, I would encourage you to book tickets to come and see our show. At the moment this year, we don't know whether that's going to run. You've got running in the background um, some of the, the, the clips from last year's performance, which was Fame. Um, previously, we've had Les Miserables, Little Shop of Horrors, School of Rock, Oliver, Grease, loads of different performances, and we really are desperate as soon as we can to get these activities started again for students. I appreciate scrolling through these videos. There may well still be some questions that you think, ah, but I want to know about X or Y. Um, can I encourage you, please? We have tried to put um, as much information as possible onto our website. Do have a look through it, the different tabs. Um, you'll see different information there. Likewise, the different presentations that people have made. And I hope to still see some of you um, coming to our school tours. These are greatly limited. We're doing them only in small numbers and we're running them only on days and evenings when students aren't here in the school. But please do book online for these and I look forward to meeting some of you there. In conclusion, um, and obviously it's a, a big decision for you students to make um, and indeed for, for you parents, how to choose the school that you will go to for your secondary school education. Um, my suggestion would be this, and it, it is my acid test behind all the different decisions that um, are taken here at Himes Park. As I said to you at the start, um, yes, I'm a, a teacher, but I'm also a parent. And in my dealings with all the students at school, I like to say, okay, would I want my child treated in the same way? Are those the values that I would want my child to hold? And that's how we work with the different students. So colleagues will always use that as their go-to measure. Is it good enough for my child? If the answer is yes, it's good enough for everybody else's children too. I look forward to seeing many of you in September. <laughs>